Meghan and Harry told to talk about nothing but the weather at Charles's coronation. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been advised to talk about nothing but the weather if they attend King Charles III's coronation in May. It is believed Harry and Meghan will be invited to the Westminster Abbey ceremony despite claims and allegations made against the royal family in their Netflix series and the Duke's memoir, Spare. Royal commentator, Kinsey Schofield, said Buckingham Palace wants to organize the historic occasion to make sure King Charles is the center of attention, but acknowledge Harry and Meghan will be a distraction if they were to attend. The host of the Today for Daily podcast told GB News, Additionally, though, this is my favorite part of everything I've been reading about the coronation, a source close to the royal family says that Harry and Meghan should be prepared to talk to senior royals about nothing but the weather, which we can all understand. Those two can't keep their mouths shut. Loose lips sink ships. Ms. Schofield told the broadcaster there are three options for those planning the coronation, Harry and Meghan both show up, only Harry attends or neither of them go. She said, we do anticipate that Harry and Meghan are going to be invited to the coronation, but, the reality is this had to be done. This was going to be a PR nightmare if King Charles did not invite Harry and Meghan to the coronation. The royal commentator suggested if the Sussexes do attend they will be seated with Princess Eugenie and Princess Beatrice, who they are known to be particularly friendly with. A special bank holiday weekend will begin when Charles is crowned monarch on Saturday, May 6 at Westminster Abbey. The day after, thousands of spectators, who have been awarded tickets via a national ballot, will watch a star-studded Windsor Castle concert as the celebrations continue. King Charles's coronation comes after the Duke's ghost-written autobiography, which became the fastest-selling non-fiction book in the UK since records began, laid bare Harry's frustrations with his family. He claimed the king put his own interests above Harry's and was jealous of Meghan and the Princess of Wales. Harry also alleged Camilla, the queen consort, sacrificed him on her personal PR altar. Buckingham Palace and Kensington Palace have not responded to the Duke's allegations. Friday saw the launch of a national ballot for a live, televised musical extravaganza on Sunday May 7, the day after the King is crowned. Members of the public are invited to apply by visiting bbc.co.uk slash coronation concert with the ballot closing just before midnight on February 28. The event, staged on the castle's East Lawn and featuring global music icons and contemporary stars, is the first time a concert has been held in the grounds of the Berkshire residence, according to the BBC. It will be broadcast live on BBC One, BBC iPlayer, BBC Radio 2 and BBC Sounds.